New grounds. That was the challenge thrown to managers and staff of the Multimedia Group Limited mother company of this network as the company marks its 20th anniversary. The occasion was a special church service to commemorate the company's two decades in existence starting in 1995 with the establishment of Joy 99.7 FM in Accra. In its seventh the head of head pastor of ICGC, Pastor Mensa Otabel, lauded the impact Joy FM and MGL in general has made on Ghana. A huge delegation comprising current staff and former workers of Multimedia Group Limited celebrated today's service with wild jubilation, thanksgiving and dancing in praise as they joined congregants of the Christ Temple. They were led by Chief Executive of the group, Kwesi Chung, who has steered the company since its inception. General Overseer of the International Central Gospel Church, Pastor Mensa Otabil, shared some fond memories of Joy FM. The first day I recorded my first Living Word broadcast was 18th of May 1995. And you say, why do I remember the date? Because that was the date my last born daughter was born. And so, in a sense, Joy is also like my last born. So uh, uh, I hold uh, that station very dear uh, to my heart and, uh, and I appreciate them. Charles Mensah and Ken Addy were employed at Joy FM when the station began operations 20 years ago. They recount their experiences. They've come a long way and uh, I was part of the initial stages and uh, looking at where we were and where they are now, I think uh, we've come a long way. I'm hoping that uh, very soon we'll be an African uh, station selling African to the world because uh, you've sold Ghana to Africa. You've sold Ghana to the world. Now you're going to sell Africa to the world. 20 years of multimedia, I think we have come far, very, very far. You know, from the humble beginnings. Did you hear what the pastor said in church? He said that uh, looking at the number of people who were here, he was just grateful that the company has been offering jobs to people out there. And he even went on to say he didn't think that the people here today were all the employees of multimedia, which is true. It goes to show how multimedia has grown and we are happy that uh, the good Lord is with us and we will keep growing. So, with the impact the multimedia group has made in the media landscape over the last 20 years, what are the prospects going forward? That's the question I pose to some staff members. Wow, multimedia's future, I shall stand here, I can say, but all I will say is, let's pray for life. If I do it and I do it well, you will do it and also do it well. I see a, a family that is bringing society together through the power of media and chatting the cause of God for society. I see a company that is affected, that will continue to affect lives than it has ever done before. I, I foresee the next 20 years of, of multimedia, I mean, very great. With the successes chopped within this milestone, there is no doubt the multimedia group will continue to be seen as a broadcasting giant, not only in Ghana, but Africa as well. Thank you.